So this here is a model of Sierpinski's triangle that I made in Excel. And uh, in this video, I'm just going to walk through how I made that model. Uh, and so what I started with here is I put ones down the first column and then increasing integers along the first row. And then uh, we're actually going to redefine this row instead of just as integers as the previous term um, plus one. So it's still going to be um, consecutive integers. Uh, and then what each of these central cells are going to be, it's going to be the addition of the cell to its left and the cell above it. And so we will continue to fill in the table. So now what we're going to do is uh, apply uh, mod 2 to all of these numbers. And the last thing we're going to do is we're going to go into uh, conditional formatting, highlight cell rules equal to if the output's 1, we'll do that. And if the output is zero, uh, we'll do yeah. And so as we continue to expand this and zoom out and format all the cells um, to the same size, and so uh, the general pattern for Sierpinski's triangle begins to form, um, as you can see here. And so here is a uh, one that I've done. I've um, expanded much further uh, in uh, red and orange. And this is, if you consider this to be uh, the main triangle of, the central triangle of Sierpinski's triangle, this carries it out four, five, six, seven, eight iterations. So this is uh, a kind of a zoomed in um, view of eight iter iterations of Sierpinski's triangle. 